right, so we're rocking a spell book. Yeah, I, I was worried about that. We are sitting on a substantial amount of Tainted Essence that should have been spent, uh, but that's okay. And holy cow, yeah, it does start it does start close, doesn't it? Um, can I even destroy this barricade? I can't. I'm serious. I feel like I should put my ranged person over here, my spellcaster back here. This is gonna be a little, a little tricky, I think. Um, all right. Well, let's not uh, let's not dilly dally. This is the deployment phase, so we need to get our. Uh, ourselves defended up for the initial wave coming in. Yeah, it's very uh, very claustrophobic, the, the distance that things are. Okay. I think we probably want to take advantage as much as possible of... Oh. Hmm. Yeah, this is, uh... Alright. Well, that's about as good as we're gonna get. We'll see what, uh, what we can do. Oh, actually, that's a bad move. Um, so we can move to here. That's half of our movement. The dodges, right off the bat, are... are killer here. Um... Plus 12 mana regen, so we should uh, we should definitely spend while we can. Spend them while we got them. It does feel like nobody's really dying. Um, can't help but notice that. I guess getting second weapons is going to be very important uh it seems now let's see Ooh, heavy bolt really doesn't have much for range does it um and that's all we had on that one and that's all our movement too i think i actually overextended on movement um probably gonna have to use uh leap next time That's bad. Wow. Apocalypse 4 comes at you fast. Uh, when you... When those dodges come in, that's rough. Um, We still have movement, so well, that's a bad, that's a bad move. I think we try and take out these two, and then I think we just move around to here, I guess. Um, we're gonna heavy bolt these two to get rid of the adjacency. Uh, now. Not, not great, but yikes! The the first night at this difficulty is uh is no slouch. Hold on, actually, um. those punches out um, I don't really have a better don't really have a better place to do that so I guess I'll do that you don't have any movement left but you can armor up and you're gonna be taking some hits so it's probably for the best Not messing around. 
Now this is this is where we run into trouble. Um, All right, well, that's panic abated. Um, we're at the halfway point on mana, which is not feeling super good. Uh, okay, if I step forward one with you, no, I'm going to start. Hmm. This is the spot that I want to hit. So if I go heavy bolt there, then explosive bolt there. The dodges are vicious. Got three actions left. I think we just try and clean up three stragglers, something like that. Uh, do you still have movement? Yeah, you can move around like that. Um, and then give this person a punch. I think we're going to be breaking out the fireball here too, even though we're going to go into a mana deficit on it. Uh, I wonder if we're better off. I think I'm going to hit him with this. Since there's two of them, they took a bunch of propagation hits there. So maybe that'll uh, that'll stabilize things. Move you back, keep you standing there, you standing there. All right. Yeah, I was gonna say he shouldn't shouldn't hit for much. Your starting weapons seem to matter a lot. Uh, Okay, so I'm going to... We're dumping all our mana. Um, hmm. I really don't have a great answer for... Okay, we can just punch this guy. I guess for over here, we just... I think a leap is the most cost-effective way to try and take that guy out. Leap plus a punch. Um, does this get a kill? No. That's going to harm our wall. Uh, if I move to here, do I, do I have a leap over, please? Okay. And then I guess this is the best that I can do. All right. Let's just weaken these folks up. Actually, that was probably a waste because I think I'm going to, uh, I think I'm going to clear out this gang here. Um, These guys are moving in, but not far enough. Um, you got one left? All right. So I think we did the first night, but... Uh, it was not particularly cheap. Um, and I will say, this... Uh, this great axe is not uh, not what we're looking for, I don't think. Um, gonna continue trying to share the kills. I think our caster got the most kills during this night. So, all right, we we spent a little bit of mana, but nothing too crazy. Was I correct? Shantae led the pack then Lamas, and then Shantala. Okay. I need to go check out the tainted, uh, tainted essence that we have and what we should be spending it on. We 
Okay, so we're sitting at 200 gold and 200 materials, which to me does mean that we got Wealthy Haven. But let's come over here and check. Yes, we looks like we did. Why I spent money on magic orbs, one will never know, but do we have, we don't have quite enough to get both of these. So let's get that one. And then we'll get uncommon items tomorrow night. Let's see what we got from our night reward. An offhand pistol, a rusty dagger, and a male coif. Three damage and crit power, or just crit power. It's gonna be the rusty dagger. Um, we need a we need a single target uh, for for you. So let's see. So. We can buy the seer and we can push back immediately, which I'm I kind of feel like we need to do. Seer costs 168. Means we need to do houses next time. But I don't think we survive without doing that as a first move. Um, but I've been wrong before. Uh, let's do our level ups. Our melee friend. We still haven't gotten someone to... The required health to... Like we have... Uh, if we head to the Oracalcum but go to the other half here... There's two uh, quests that we've been exposed exposed to over here. One is to kill nine with a single action. Uh, and we've gotten close, but we've never quite gotten there. A um, hundred stunned enemies as well. Those are the three that we know about. Do we already have a hero that's this close? That seems incorrect to me. Are there any? I don't think there are any hidden either. So we just have those three. I don't know if now is the time to do that, but let's take a look at the hit points of our characters. 150. Yeah, so not really. Um, Chantala we could take a big step in the right direction with, but it comes at the cost of damage, which... I don't know if that's such a great idea. So let's go back to level ups. I'm more inclined to go with armor, but maybe we go with health and we try and do like a vampirism build. Uh, I will get the daily health regen though, because that converts into armor. Uh, I'm a little worried we're going to be doing some body blocking, but I think we can get away with doing avid learner still. Okay, we'll take the range damage here. And I'm gonna roll that once. All right, take accuracy. That's pretty good. And avid learner, especially for our first characters, I think it's critically important that we get them leveling up quickly. Ooh, a lot of move points. Momentum's not something we're looking for here. Take some accuracy, though. Now, while we're at it, I want to just quick take a quick look here. So you are soldier, skill range, and mystic. Wow, that's somewhat sad. Although, honestly, the dagger will work well with skill range. Thief. Man, our... We don't have a great lineup for... Uh, <laughs> for our, uh, our character's abilities. Um... We have 39. Let's take a look in the shop just very quickly here. Offhand magic orb is not interesting. We'll 
Fae Cape is somewhat interesting, but let's actually, let's take a look at gear very quickly here, because I didn't take a look at this before. So I got accuracy on you, an extra action point on you. I want the block on, on this character, because we haven't found the shield yet. Um, also, the nasal helm is better served here. Lamas is better served with that one. Now, are you going to be able to use all of your action points with this setup? Probably. We'll probably be able to swing that. All right. So we got the seer. We're saving for next time. Uh, we need to get scavenger camps, etc., lined up. All right, I think this is going to be our configuration. So let's uh, let's get into night two. Yeah, we're not using materials. We could put down one ballista, but I think for the moment we don't. I'm hoping we don't need it. Famous last words. Let's prep up. Here goes nothing. Okay. All right, so we're gonna leap in here. Um, don't think there's a better uh, better way to do that. Uh, but now we we'll got some stabs on the way home. Do need to get this guy down, but that's okay. Nice hit. I am going to toss a lightning in here to soften folks up. Okay, that looked pretty good. To be able to use the heavy bolts, I need to bring them out. All right, not bad. We can move to there. We did leave a few a few action points on the uh, on the table, but that's okay. You still have one? All right, you're not doing anything with it though. Now the fun begins. Okay, so we're going to start out with as many big clusters as we can get. Move over one, we get a nice juicy one of those, and then again, a few drive-bys on the retreat. All right. That was a that was a bad uh, a bad lightning, and I should have seen the potential for it to turn out that way. But you really got to manage your propagations. Gonna focus on the the front runners here. My kingdom for another another action point. But what are you gonna do? I want to. I want to use up those. Uh, let's see. Can I? I can still move back if I go to here. So I'm gonna try and drop that guy. And then, off. What do we? What do we get for this? Nothing. No. We gotta. We gotta hold off on spending our mana. So it's gonna be armor up and and retreat to hold the line here. I think. Hey, I'm walking here. All right. So 
So, okay, so if I want to get a leap in, I think I can do it from here. Very unfortunate. Um... Oh, that, that, though, was really the icing on the cake there. Uh, that was a good hit, though. This should be very unlikely to dead end. Somehow it still managed to, though. Are you dead? No, you're not dead. You are dead. All right. So, unfortunately, we do need to still nuke this guy. And then you're, these ones aren't moving too far. This one we should probably work on and then I don't have I mean this one gets a lot of kills uh, we're already kind of at the point where I'm not super excited about well let's let's see what we can do over here because we do have we do have an explosive bolt that let's use the explosive bolt here I'm going to heavy bolt this guy on the way back. I could probably punch them, actually. So if I move to here, then I move to here, that's three, four, five. That's the movement points that I have left. Oh, wait, but the punch isn't going to kill this guy all by itself. Um... So if I move one more out, Impaling Bolt is two action points, though. Hmm. I think that was the best we could do. Okay, now... You have three action points left. And they're just a... Boatload. Yeah, again... We have the action points. We don't have. We don't have the ability to to utilize them fully. Okay. Well, doesn't get much better than this. I need to get one more in to be able to get super spin not uh not hitting our walls i guess i guess we i guess we drill in two because i i think this is probably worth it and then we have the dagger so let's do a bit of clean up there all right Going to take the guaranteed kills here. Hmm. I think, yeah, we just have to get numbers down at the moment. I feel like I punched this guy twice. <laughs> Not... Not what I wanted to do. Um, we have five action points here to continue trying to clean some fools up. Oh. Yeah, we really... I mean, I can move all the way out here, punch this one in the face, and then move back, I guess. Uh... Don't need you. Don't need you taking any hits. All right. Definitely taking some damage there. Um, hmm. I think I need a couple. If 
I get all of them? No. So we actually can just punch this guy. They certainly do make punch more valuable. Uh, <laughs> famous, famous last observations. Can't help but feel like Lamas did not get uh, nearly as many kills as I was hoping. But we cleaned up Knight 2. Without, without depleting our mana too much, we're definitely a little off full health. How did I do splitting things up? Shantala leaded the, led the pack. Leaded. Led the pack by a mile. Okay, so this is the turn to get uh, to get some some houses built, etc. Um, wow, we're already moving to two directions, eh? Hmm. Let's see what our night reward is. That's ten percent magic damage on an amulet, which is pretty good. Uh, hair on my microphone. Uh, what would Lamas, what would you be replacing? Accuracy? And Lamas is our caster, right? Yes. That might be the play. Uh, hmm. So how do we... We have a bunch of money, but I think we do need to repel again. Give ourselves a little bit of breathing room. So we do that, and then Lamas, are you gonna hard carry aside? I think we're gonna go with this configuration and have Shantae rotating between the two. Uh, but none of these help us much. I think we grab that one. It is it is an improvement here, but basically just a 10% magic increase. Um, now we have one worker left. So we break that, and then we need to get some housing built up. So this round, ooh, profits fail. We might need to spend some money on a rifle could be good, potentially, or we could roll the dice on a bower. Um, but I think at the very least we need a house, and then we have 90 left. So basically we could buy a rifle or we could buy a bower. Start getting some ranged weapons built up. Or we could build a gold mine. I'm inclined to say build the gold mine. I think we build the gold mine, and then we spend the last 30 gold shopping. Oh, I missed the... I missed the top row here. We were scrolled. Um... Journeyman's Wand is very tempting. Can sell the boots. That gets us up to 40. So the reason I'm thinking the Journeyman's Wand is we've done a good job. <sighs> Journeyman's Wand versus the rifle. The rifle is good for slowing things down. But the problem is we had a real action economy problem on Lamas. Didn't have the ability to use up all of his actions. So I think the wand is where we have to go. Whoops. Now we have two more folks. We can get more money out of this. 
And then is there anything we can... Yeah, we can tear this down for one. Which might... That gets us to the rifle. So I think we buy the rifle. Just so that all of our characters are maxing out their actions. They have something that they can do. Is the best, is the best uh, preparation. And then... We're going to put a mounted ballista here. And a mounted ballista here. All right. Now we only got one gold mine built, which is unfortunate. Uh, I wanted to get a bit more economy rolling this round, but I think this was what we had to do. And we'll have more workers next round. Uh, we also haven't increased Chantala's uh, resilience very much, but we're going to hopefully work on that now. See, I'd have to take health again, but I need to get her damage up. We're not really doing a momentum build yet. It might change at some point in the future. But I think that was the build. Coagulation is an easy one to take here. And then... Probably Crit Master, I think. Chante, our ranged dealer. Gets a nice bump to range damage. That's a roll. More range damage. Just want them hitting as hard as humanly possible. Yep. More range. More damage. Give me all the damage. Crit Master is an easy take. And then... Steady aim. Lamas. Our caster. I'll take the blue mana. It's not it's not what I was looking for, but more damage is good. I'll take some skill range when I see it. Um Crit Master. I'm tempted by back protection, honestly, in this case, but I think uh I think steady aim when we don't have to move is is a good one to take. Alright, so We've got our plan. We're floating 91 materials. We don't have a lot of gold left. We have we have what we're going to have. We're continuing to push the fog back. All right. Oh, we can uh, we can get the uh, the next level of uh, of item production. Now, would it be better to get more rare items? Uh, let's... Well... Well, now I'm committed. <laughs> After clicking that twice. Um, yeah, we'll keep them at both at the... Uh, moving at the same speed, I think. Alright, I think it's, it's go time. So at the moment, I feel like this side is the more uh, the more scary side at the moment. Um, let's use a punch to get them out of the way. Oh. Okay, let's let's see how much work we can do over here, I guess. So Sword of Damocles does less damage than Shadow Bolt. Oof. We 
have one action point left. I think we get the speedy dude out. Oh, I missed this guy completely. All right, so before we go any further, I think we got to drop them. All right, that's all we get there. So that's our action points spent. Shouldn't shouldn't be letting myself take hits on my on my caster, but Yeah. But getting getting these ones that are doing the end run around is going to be uh no easy task. Let's move back one. Try and get that last kill off. Okay, what are, what are we working with over here? This is the most likely lightning bolt to do work. Um, I think we got a fireball here for reasons. We're burning through mana. We got four hits. Okay. So, let's see. so if I move you down like this, it's a very expensive way to not secure that many kills. Um, <laughs> now, did you get your one off lethal? Aren't you my favorite? Um, Get rid of the runners. Uh, we're gonna have to. This this bat problem is gonna get taken care of that way. Um, yep, that bat's into the panic zone. That was underwhelming. I think this is gonna do a U shape there, so that's, yep, that's as good as I'm gonna be able to get. Hoping this guy gets taken out. He's probably gonna go after the ballista. Maybe we move to here to block, body block the ballista. Um. Hold on, actually. Undo that move. So, where is the where is the winning spin to win? Looks like it's right here. It's on. So this this one here needs to die. Okay. Two actions left has got actually hold on. If you move to here. Not getting this one was a bummer, but you're dead though, so now if I move to here and hip shot this one. This 
This bat is gonna is gonna be slightly annoying. Um I think that's the best the best we can do. Thank you. We're definitely using our hit points. Um, okay, let's focus on... the ones in the walls. Use one of our bad casts for the second cast there. I tried at least twice to get this guy. All right, and then you can just barely sneak in a hit on that guy there. All right. Get rid of the panic. Blow them up. Not bad. Well, that was disappointing. Uh, but I think... We're in pretty good shape. We got two over here and two over there. All right. Now, I am firmly of the opinion that uh, that I think our axe friend really cleaned up in a big way on this night. Thirty-four, thirty-two, twenty-five. Okay. Oh, getting we're getting crushed by the fog here. I tell you what. Uh, like, are we just breaking even on the fog? Hello, Siren, my old friend. Not what we wanted to see here. Uh, Damage pants are not terrible. It's going to be these. Movement point is good. All right, someone will wear those. Now we have three workers left. We don't have any, any singles anymore, so I think we... I think we do the gold. Well, actually, I think we do, we do, we, we invested in the mine. We need to get as much out of it as we can. Which puts us short of the inn. So does this become a... Let's do that, and then I think we also need to invest in another house. Which gets us a bit more cash to spend on gear, I think. Uh, now, everyone has two items, which is a good start. Focus ring with two AP on it is pretty huge. 
but you take a you take a damage hit. But two AP is a lot of AP. Um, I have to get our our folks' names right. Chantala, Shantae, and Lamas. So Shantae, you already have a one AP item. Hmm. Let's do our level ups really quickly. Gosh, you already have 10 mana regen? I need to look at everyone's gear. I think that's what I'm learning. Uh, for perks, I was thinking about going health and then going for vampire. Um, but I think armor master. Oh my gosh, no wonder you have so much mana regen. Yeah, we need to get you more mobile, so that'll be the play. Uh, I can't even see what these pants are without moving them. Reliability and dodge, plus three mana. More damage and more movement for you. You have accuracy pants right now. Yeah, the fur pants are pretty good. Liquidate one pair of pants. And I think we can we can save a bit of money because we're not gonna be able to buy we're not gonna be able to build anything in construction mode, right? Oh, we could build a scavenger camp, and actually I think I want to do that. So we get a little more in terms of defenses. We're getting pummeled on these two sides. Um Let's do another level up. Get some more range damage in the house. Now, you have isolated on... on assassinate. So we could go for the huge isolated. And when we get a longbow, that'll pay off big too. So we'll grab that. Now, there's one other one that I was like, oh, I really should have gotten X. I don't think it's on you. On isolated targets, we just grab patience so we can roll over one. All right, and last but not least, more damage, please. We had a druid staff. I would take the big poison damage. Maybe we expect to get one. No, I don't think so. Let's take the accuracy. Get magic fuel. All right. So, the blisters are one twenty. Since you don't even have enough for two. Let's put one there. Hope it can clean up some of the corner shenanigans. And once again, we're going to start with you there. You there. Three gold is all we have, eh? I think, oh, because of the scavenger camp. That's right. Ah, oh, we do have a worker left. So not a lot of places to spend them. Um, could do guesswear, but I think if we do this, does that actually get us our second mounted ballista? does.
feel like I can't protect it right now, though, so I'm not going to. I'm going to float a bit of material. 